So whilst one of these sides has sailed through already, there is still plenty at stake for the other. The only mission left is for them to wrap up what remains of this group stage, preferably in style, and a win here against their immediate rivals would go some way towards achieving that. The difference in mood between the two camps then really could not be much more profound. On the one hand, utter comfort and confidence, even coziness. On the other hand, uncertainty and urgency are the preeminent words. The Emirates are washed with red and white, a sea of Arsenal, just as you would anticipate. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Pierre, Emmerich, Aubameyang, Peter. It's his pace that's his main attribute, especially over those first few yards, where he just seems to glide away from defenders, gets himself into great positions, and likes to hit it hard and nice and early. That's a horrible combination for any defence that's trying to deal with him, I can tell you that. Not to disagree with that, it is the sort of situation he thrives in. And that gets things running. Partey. And it's Maitland-Niles. Gets the better of his man. An early chance there, first of the game. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Gorgeous control there. It's come loose. Zielinski gets it back. Di Maria. And here's Mertens. Lozano has a look to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. to get it forward quickly. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Needed to be better than that, and he knows it. He gets past his man. That's a throw. Obama Yang. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Mertens. And it's been taken straight back. Zielinski spreads it towards the left. Look at the defender bombing forward. Hits it first time! Oh, that is rather wayward.
Fabian Ruiz battles to win it back. It's Di Maria. He could be in here. Fabian Ruiz. And it's Mernier. Chance to shoot. It's Di Maria! Di Maria usually is so good from that range. He didn't quite connect as he can, though. to Niles. Now it's Opa. Big chance! He's missed, but not by that far. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Fabian Ruiz. Pate drives it forward. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back here. Lozano looking to get on the end of this. Lozano! And he heaves it forward. Forward it goes. Partey. Partey is fouled. Fabian Ruiz gets his final warning. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression before the ref does it for him, Peter. Ball. Who's going to get that? And here's up. He's gone for it. Strength too strong for his opponent. Mario Rui. And that'll be the final action of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless perhaps after half time <laughs> that gets things going for the second half well the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked hopefully they've been safe for the, the second for that to be the case though we'll need to see more energy and invention early on chance Partey plays it forward. Ah, oh, that's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and, and just get something in the way. Maximovic. Mertens. Mertens takes the long option. Oh, managed to get it away. Torreira. Jordan Henderson. Now it's Obamia. Maitland Niles. And here's Obamiang. Obamiang really got caught in a trap there and he just couldn't get out. Big chance, must be! But he's had a shot! It's there! And finally he has great luck! into the game 
The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. That's always a great sight, you know, on a football pitch. Nimble footed, showed great balance and a really cool head to finish. And that kind of dribbling is really smart. Napoli take the lead, 1-0. Well, half-time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. Quick glance at goal. Ball's loose, who's getting there? That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Hoists it forward. Partey is onto it and can take it up. In with a header! Oh, just needed a better contact. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. Lozano. Maitland Niles, and it's played forward. Oh, this looks promising. Got to make this count. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Lozano. And that's got paid to a promising move. Just the goalkeeper to beat. Oh, the referee's got a decision to make here. What's he going to give? Well, the referee's decided that he was fouled outside the box, and it is just a free kick. Well, you can blame some suspect defensive positioning for that set of circumstances, and they were just left with little choice. He's having a go. And it's David Luiz. Going for goal! Disappointing finish in the end. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Mario Rui. Insigne tries to get it forward quickly. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed. But will they? Henderson does well there. Alert. Rapidly approaching the end. Arsenal have the look of condemned men. Elimination almost a certainty now. Well weighted. Lacazette. Arsenal have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Almost there, and the players can feel it. Napoli. Probably could have killed things off, but they should be okay here. Now it's Obamia. Oh, 
Foden. Ward shows there will be three extra minutes. What a ball this has turned out to be. And out to safety. And that is that. Napoli, hold on. It's a narrow squeak, a bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, qualification may have been confirmed with a game to spare, but they were determined to end on a high, almost as if they're sending a message to say, we're not backing off on this, we want it.